perhaps a new round of talks between Israeli and Palestinian leaders. The news came on Wednesday after Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu met with U.S. Middle East envoy George Mitchell and were the first sign of progress since Netanyahu began his European tour on Tuesday. According to media reports, President Abbas accepted to meet with Netanyahu at the U.N. next month, perhaps a three-way summit with President Barack Obama. Whether this means real peace talks will start is open to question. Mahmoud Abbas said he wouldn't reopen peace negotiations until Israel freezes its settlement activity. So far, Netanyahu has refused to do so despite pressure from the U.S. and the EU. And his true friends d'Israël doivent vous dire la vérité. There will be no peace as long as there is the pursuit of settlements. Avec la poursuite de la colonisation. Europe and Washington have been pushing Israel to halt its settlement activity. According to The Guardian, Israel could accept under certain conditions. For example, if tougher sanctions are taken against Iran, or if Arab countries engage in diplomatic ties with the Jewish state. According to polls, 39 percent of Israelis would back a settlement freeze if such gestures are made. On Thursday, Netanyahu will meet with Angela Merkel. The German chancellor said the opportunity to resume peace talks is there and shouldn't be missed.